When CUDA bus driver Jocelyn Jordan was involved in this accident with the rider truck, it was later determined that Jordan was at fault. So far, she has only received a three-day suspension and is currently on leave. So when you're sharing the road with Coda, what's being done to make sure they're driving safely? For some, it's a real concern. This is ridiculous, you know, somebody's going to get killed. Bill Smith has been riding Coda for nearly 20 years and says he has seen Coda drivers run red lights and use excessive speed. He says he was almost in an accident when a Coda driver ran a red light right in front of him. I was coming up to the intersection and I had the green light and he had the red and he was coming down Graceland and he just blew the red light. Coda tracks what are called preventable accidents with their drivers. For example, hitting a street sign could be considered one preventable accident, while rear-ending a car in front of a bus would count as two. We investigated and found over the last three years, Coda buses have been involved in 441 preventable bus accidents. In the last five years, out of 400 drivers, only 18 have been fired due to accidents like these. You can see them hitting the side mirrors on poles or street signs, hitting parked cars or mailboxes. The most severe is when a bus hits a car in front of them. Again, that wreck alone counts as two preventable accidents on a driver's record. The individual stats don't look good. Over the last five years, the coded drivers that were terminated for accidents were responsible for hitting another car 26 times. 20 accidents involved a bus hitting a street sign or another object causing damage. Four drivers ran their bus into another bus. And four times in five years, a passenger was injured by a bus. If you and I had driving records like this, we probably wouldn't be able to drive for our job and our insurance companies, they might cancel us. So we wanted to know what it takes for the repeat offenders to be fired. Coda spokesperson Beth Berkemer says their accident policy allows drivers to have three preventable accidents in 12 months before they are fired. So you could have a driver with two preventable accidents on his record every year and still be driving because accidents are wiped clean after 12 months. Coda claims that's a rare event a situation that doesn't happen often. Our main goal first is safety. Again, safety for our operators, safety for our customers. However, we learned that 97 drivers had two preventable accidents over the last three years. Out of CODIS 400 drivers, that's 25% of their workforce that had problems. We also found that out of the 18 that were fired, at least five drivers were having the same accident over and over again within that 12-month time period. Is there a point where you look at a driver maybe after the second time and start seeing a pattern? Absolutely, our trainers are exceptional. Five seconds, okay, between that vehicle and what? And this bus. I went to the Coda Training School and sat in on one of their refresher classes. Bergamer says the key to prevention is training and that all drivers start retraining on their first preventable accident, as well as a mandatory refresher course once every year. Let them know what you are doing up here, that you're about to do what? Stop and flag the railroad tracks. We want them to practice that and practice that and understand it and, and really be comfortable with it before they go on the road. And our trainers determine that. Berkemer says that if they have a driver that has the same type of accident every time, trainers will retrace steps and focus on how to correct it.